Hi folks. Well, it has been quite a while since I've posted regular videos about things that we've been doing here, living out in the country on a shoestring. It's not that I haven't been doing anything, I just haven't taken the time to video it. So I want to make up for that. I'm going to do a series of short videos of some new things just to uh, bring you up to speed on what we've been up to. Uh, I'll, I don't know if I'll post them all at once or over the course of a couple weeks, but it'll be more content for you to watch. Now one of the things obviously that I've been doing this winter and into this spring is I have been splitting firewood. That's an ongoing task here. We had a mild winter so it wasn't too bad to try to work and I hauled an awful lot out of the woods and brought it down here with my splitter. Some of it's already stacked, some of it's on a pile waiting to dry. But about a year ago my wife got me an attachment for my log splitter here. You've seen it in operation, I have other videos of it, so I won't try to go through it again. And I don't really need to demonstrate this attachment for you to understand it. But uh, what I want to show you is she got me this side rack for the splitter. Now that seems like it's nothing a big deal, but I'll tell you what, it saves a ton of time and lifting when you're splitting. If you get a big log big round here and you split it in half it would tend to flop off or you'd have to drop half of it off so that you can continue to split it smaller but with this rack I can take a big piece split it in half push the other half and let it sit there and then keep splitting down the other half here till I have it to the size I want and then bring that one up or if I have some smaller ones I can put two or three pieces on there and I don't have to keep going and getting more bending down. Uh, it's a, it was a pain in the neck always having to bend down, pick it up off the ground and you know do it again. It's not that none fall now but it's a whole lot better as far as a time saver goes. I can't remember what she paid for. It was just a tractor supply. It was no big deal and it's um, heavy duty metal as you can see here. Heavy duty steel. It'll hold the weight you know it holds on there and it's really just let's see if I can see that there two bolts let me get down here so you can see it better maybe you can and I couldn't see it through the view screen there we go it's just two bolts through the frame of the log splitter two bolts and nuts and the holes were already in this log splitter the designer of this bracket figured where they were located so they designed it so that you didn't have to do any extra drilling or whatever clamping and it fits on there now if I had to take it off to go somewhere or do something uh, it's just the two bolts to loosen that's all but it's a small thing but it will save you a ton of time with your log splitting makes it a whole lot more efficient and you know how time consuming dealing with firewood can be and it's not a huge I, it was I don't know if she paid $70 for it or whatever it was. I can't remember anymore. Um, but it's been a great addition to this operation for producing firewood every year, processing firewood every year. So I just want to mention that to you. If you have a log splitter like this, get yourself one of these. You will thank me for doing that. So thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe as we continue to live out in the country on a shoestring.